the burden is we should be one with the Lord in releasing His people. Amen. Saints, we are those I sign up today. We need to hear the calling of the Lord. We need to preach the gospel of our God for the people of this world to be released. Yaman tayo na release na kailangan tayo ay maging kapahati na pag-release naman sa marami pang mga kaklase ninyo. While you are young, do not despise your youth. In school, just preach the gospel. We cannot preach whom we do not know. That's why if we are going to announce Christ, we need to know Him. Hallelujah for Christ as the servant of Jehovah. He is the indwelling Christ, serving in our spirit. He is serving by supplying God Himself as our supply. And now because He has served us, we can now serve Him. That's why young people, let us stand firm and rise up. Forsake all idols. Amen. To testify that true and living God is in our spirit. This must be the, the result and issue of this conference. Amen. We, should, we should learn how to touch the Lord. We can touch God in our spirit. We don't need the thousands of pictures and models of the Lord Jesus just to be able to touch Him. Amen. All of these are blasphemous and worthless. Amen. These are not real. No fixed image. But yet, deep within us, when we use our spirit, you can touch Him. Oh, Lord Jesus! Such a privilege to meet such a wonderful person! Being this full salvation to us! Christ was crushed for our sins. He took away all our infirmities. Seemingly, He was, he was weak. He got defeated. But Christ resurrected from the dead! He resurrected to produce a seed! We are the seeds! The extension of Christ! I hope all of us, we would all have a part in this extension of Christ. There should be an extension of Christ in all campuses! How will it come about? Through the seed here! The whole world is thirsty for God. But that thirst has to be met and to be satisfied with something real. Tell them, everyone who thirst, come to the waters. I am here because God captivates me and separates me from the worldly enjoyment. The picture of a lifetime has been a wake-up call for me to be separated from what the world can offer and be drawn into everything that is of Christ. He came not to be served, but to serve. He served us in the past, He is serving us today, and He will still serve us in the future. Lord doesn't need of my human ability, but He has to serve me. All we need to do is to allow Him work within us in order for us to testify that our Lord is the real one. Bear the Lord's testimony is not an easy matter. It requires us to live, remain, and even exercise our spirit. Let's prepare our heart away for Jehovah that every part and every avenue of it be strengthened through repentance. Brothers and sisters, we are commissioned by the Lord to preach Him into His chosen people to preach the gospel to our friends and classmates. I realize how glorious it is to preach the gospel because what we are preaching here is the all-inclusive Christ. The Lord is indeed blessing us. Right now, Tour of a Lifetime is in four places. Baguio, Malabon, Naga, and Banawe. Praise the Lord! Right? So we hope that more and more young people uh, will be gained by the Lord. Oh,